forgot to sing Immaculate. I had to feel bad. It was probably the most interesting movie I've seen in 2024. Yeah, Every yeah. other movie has been crap or trash. I think that City Sweetie is the best part of the whole film. She carries the... She is the film. Without her, yeah. there is no film. I will say I got my partial prediction so I stay you right. I can't go more detail about what it is without spoiling for The ending could have been... It could have been cut down a little bit. Because yeah. even the audience was like, come on now. like, Yeah. Speed it up a little. Come yeah. on. What, go, what happens? I, I, the I ending will... could be... And you got... You guys will understand why I say that if you guys go see it. Mm. The ending needs to be cut a little bit because it's way too long. I will say this much. From the first 15 minutes, I knew what, I knew what was going to happen. I knew exactly what was going to happen. I told her. Yeah. I told her what was going to happen. I like, mean, I, I can see why it yeah, happened. Yeah, and yeah. And anybody else I pre would have done the same. If you're not, if you, if you don't watch a lot of dark movies. This one's probably going to be the darkest one. My, my mother can watch this. Oh no! My my grandma and don't know my mom's side family. There's a scene though. Woo! That she, <laughs> that Sydney. Woo! Thank God that was not real technically, yeah. but <sighs> it is not something for everybody to watch. It's not something a thirteen year old. Would, no. A thirteen year old would have nightmares. This it's not will... PG. Is this PG thirteen? This is right on. Okay, good, because it's not. It's right This on. is not even close to PG thirteen. I will I will say no. this much. Like, the last scene of the film, it's like, what the heck did I just watch? It makes sense. It makes sense why it happened. Absolutely it does. But it's just... Which is, I'm saying anybody else would have probably done the same. I think any other film would have gone the way it did, as far as it did, that makes sense. But Sydney, she she's a great actress. I, I, I would definitely awesome. say watch this in theaters. Oh yeah, for sure. But, go, go see it in theaters. But Be prepared to be... That's if you're into where this goes. Like, this if, is... The, if you're into seeing people getting things shoved into them and you see it or if you're into like this is people a, getting their hand i'm not saying anyone gets their hand cut off but if you are into seeing that then go and see it and you're okay with that go and this see is it. beyond messed up very gruesome this is a psychological thriller to say the least it will up if um if you allow it to between if you ask me between this imaginary and nights which was the best one this is Without this a question. Tops all oh, by way. far. I mean, this one, <laughs> out of all the films I've seen this year, this is the best one. Yeah. It sticks with you. It's something you're going to talk about a lot. I would give it a solid 7 out of 10. I'd give it a 10 out of 10. <laughs> oh, wow, really? Yeah. A 10 out of 10. And you said Sydney produced it? Yes. Holy girl, you did good. Yeah. You did good. I will, I will like... say this much. <laughs> There's not a lot of character depth given. No. They give you the bare minimum with that. I Like I said, though, I personally Usually with these like reviews I don't really have a lot to talk about with this one. <laughs> I, I will say this much. I knew from the first scene of the film what was gonna happen. No, he like, kinda he didn't I, know it, but he, I, I guessed it pretty and then 50, 30 minutes I'm like, hey, this is what they're gonna do. Guess what? I got it right. I, I pretty much knew be out. So if you are someone who doesn't like violence, especially with religion, don't and watch seeing this. the hardcore, like seeing actually it happen. Some don't stuff watch happened. It. Definitely don't because watch this. a lot this. of stuff. <laughs> Even yeah. in the beginning, something happened. Yeah. And it, there's a lot of jump scares too. And you do not. They're not like jump scares you see in scary movies. This is not imaginary night no. smell. This, this is, is not. This is not like how jump scares that you know it's coming. Oh yeah. No, there's a lot of jump scares and they will get. This one they messes will, with your mind a the, lot. Yeah. So they did a great job making this movie for yeah. sure. But Sydney. Props to you. Like, oh my god. I would honestly go as far as to say this might be my top 10 favorite movies of the year. Yeah. I quite enjoyed this. Oh my god, yes. At first, it starts out the way you think it's a start off, but it's such a specific I'm not into watching it. I'm like, yeah, it's, I kind of want to watch it. Cause it and I'm glad we watch it together. Yeah. And guess what? I'm bringing in Papa Cash and Jaren Washers tomorrow night because I'm making them watch it too. Because I can guarantee they're, they're like, okay, well, it goes this direction. Then, no, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. So, as always, that's the thoughts. Thank you for watching. Any last words? No. <laughs> no? You recommend this? Good job, Sydney. Um, yeah, watch it in theaters. All right. Watch this it guy's... in theaters because it's dark. Yes. You have to watch it but in theaters. But again, this is the one feel about it. It's say. better on the big screen. Don't bring your children to watch Don't this. If you want your children to be traumatized and have need to counseling and therapy for the rest of their lives, go take them to watch this. This that's is exactly what's going to happen. And they're going to blame you for the rest of your life. They're going to end up in rehab. It just 
I have a what question for you. People do what they want to do, so I'm not going to tell anyone to do anything. Yeah. So just do what you want to do, but I would not recommend this for children. You wish? Okay, let me, let me ask you this question. What? Last scene in particular, do you wish they would have... Cut it down? No, sh shown it. Absolutely. I, I know why they didn't. Uh, oh, I know why, too. I, I know why. That would have... Woo! That would have been... they would have shown that... That would have made it non-rated. Absolutely. Yeah, for sure. Because it was that bad. Yeah. And, I mean, it's... So, subscribe for my dad and Jaren's reaction to this tomorrow night. Thank you for watching, as always. For more views with this beautiful girl here, hit that like button and comment below. Mrs. Cash is awesome. Appreciate y'all. Peace.